Desmond. Oh, Desmond, oh. Can you hear me? Are you in there? Damn it. What the? Oh. Ah, it's oh. 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 What? It's V's gameplays. I saw something there. Maybe it's actually him. Maybe the shaded figure or the uh yeah, that that guy is actually you. Maybe. He's part of you, he said, so maybe he is you. Is he? I don't know. Ah. Oh. What? Well, we're still here, aren't we? Man, I hope I'm not stuck in here forever. Time will tell. Patience and grace. Here, I think you can handle what's in your locked room now. Oh. If you have any unfinished business, take care of it and meet me on the roof when you're ready. Meet, me, meet you in the roof. Okay. Alright. Let's go to his room. Let's see what, what's happening here. Still the same, but big moon. Big biggie moon. Why the why are you queuing the music? Oh, it's playing right now. Milton Haven Emergency Broadcast System Shinra Bedroom Key Do I have anything around here? I don't think so, right? Eyes Damn, so creepy. It's those guys! Maybe he knows them. Maybe he actually knows them. Okay. It's filled with darkness as well. I think it's actually messing with me. What's on, the, what's on my mind? What isn't? I don't feel good. Death. There's an odd smell in the building. I miss her. The weight of the world. Is Tanya actually a... Okay. Ten human years. Okay, it's actually a kitten. Tanya couch potato whales. Age ten human years. A uh, ten human years, I mean. Um, mild kittenhood trauma stemming from possible abandonment. A bad abnormal levels of laziness that sometimes border on clinical lack of motivation to move or care and or care about her surroundings suspected borderline personality disorder uh, circumstances of treatment showed up at my door on a rainy night some nine and a half years ago frail and malnourished malnourished uh, talkative and sweet Talkative, huh? Hmm. She seemed unharmed, and she'd either been uh, she'd either been lost or for forgotten or thrown out. I decided that since she was kind enough to choose me, I shall take her and more uh, her in and nourish her uh, back to health. In personal history, somewhat unknown origins, catatonia displays that the kind of regal behavior. Uh, that likely links her to a long lineage of royalty dating back to ancient Egypt. Hmm. Using my very best uh, judgment, I'd say she is either a direct descendant of Bastet or the very soul of the feline goddess herself, who has bestowed the, the honor of care upon yours truly. 
um, psychological notes prone to occasional freezing Tonya will sometimes stand perfectly <laughs> still as if in a catatonic state she exhibited this behavior often as a kitten and less often as, a, as she reached adulthood uh, and relaxed into her surroundings uh, this demon wizard trapped in a cat's body has definite magic powers 10 years into our relationship and I have yet to consider uh, to understand why do I get considered okay never mind uh, how can she, uh, how she can melt my heart and soften my mind with a single look of ador- adoration single meow oh Desmond Wales a thought experiment laced with beer patient me age 41 diagnosis diagnosis paradoxical par, um, paradoxically paranoid circumstances of treatment patient is fo- uh, following the good psychological practice of self-analysis patient uh, considered fo- finding a third party professional but stop it but ultimately deciding that this could uh, result in unwanted prying into a past best al- left alone uh, following the death and disappearance of several people under his care patient has come to seriously question his methods and de- whether or not he is also at risk patient has difficulty reconciling with the fact that no matter how much he works on himself it won't bring Magdalene Magdalena back okay who's Magdalena uh, personal history born and raised in Milton Haven the only child of Jack and Melinda Wales um, Magdalena um, undergraduate degree in neurology and sem- sem- semiotics from Pacific State College okay so Pacific might be at Washington and uh, graduated with honors medically medical school at Virgil Met residency at Akron Falls Medical Center Medical Center likes long walks on the beach and being bad at video games ah yes just like me for being bad at video games not like long long walks on the beach but better video games yes yes that's me psychological notes patient has doubts about the methodology of his treatment is he providing his patients with the best possible professional advice or is he unconscious uh, is he consciously or unconsciously driving them to self-destruction patient's mind is consumed with worry for his own safety Safe, uh, what if what happened to them will happen to me? Is danger lurking at every corner? Magdalena, Magdalena once told me that I'm incapable of ta- taking care of my own issues since I'm always knee deep in other people's problems. Assuming she's correct, how do I change that about myself? Should I? Dear, my dearest Tanya, Tanya. My heart is heavy with grief. The void you have left behind is unexpected. Words alone cannot describe how sorry I am for my actions. My ignorance of the toxic relationship between the cat and the lily flower has left me, left me smart and, a smarter man who, looks, who feels like a fool. Uh, I sit in my office slipping into, into memories of you knocking shit off my table and uh, looking at me for affirmation, affirmation. Uh, thoughts of you sitting beside me, curiously listening to the troubles of others and helping them by accepting their flaws and letting them pet you are and forever will be priceless moments. Thank you, my dear friend, for countless days of playful calm, for reciprocated love, and for choosing me, Desmond. Oh, I'm guessing that the reason why you, you hear those things, like uh, something's knocking down on the floor and then it, everything on the desk, is because of Tanya. 
Okay. Desmond, please don't hate me for this. I know you'd say that you won't. <laughs> you wouldn't, but I know you. You gave me four years for which I am eternally grateful. The time we spent together means the world to me. And I know I, it did. I know it did for you as well, despite everything. But big, a uh, big but coming. But I can't just. I just can't do it anymore. I want happiness. This one, happiness. I know it comes from a good place. For uh, but your overprotectiveness of me and your increasing paranoia about who knows what I'm at the moment are making me crazy and doubtful. You're so special, so smart, and so loving, but you sometimes can see past your emotions and problems more often than not. Uh, how can you be there for me when you're barely uh, able to leave your own head? I sometimes question how you ever end up choosing a career being there for other people. I love you, Desmond. I'm sorry. Take care of Tanya. Magdalena. I'm so sad. So she left, and then Tanya died. Now what? Still nothing there. Hmm. And then now, I guess, you could just, uh, go to the roof, right? These are still the same things, yeah. Hmm. Okay. Let's go. challenge of a lifetime. You may have won the battle, but you've only saved yourself. Agent Rainbow is still out there, and you are powerless to stop what's coming. Don't listen to him. He's afraid because he knows exactly what you're capable of. What am I capable of? Time will tell. Patience and grace. So, this is goodbye? You said goodbye before. I wouldn't lose any sleep on it. I'm sorry. It was my fault. I should have known. You did your best. You loved me, and that's all I ever cared about. Besides, I live on. In your head, so that's something. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Tanya. For everything. Better. You're a real cool cat. Mm. Yeah. I know. How to accelerate patience and grace. Huh. Patience. Yeah. So that's it. That was a really good. That was a really good game, but they made it way too hard on the end, maybe, or uh, they they gave us too many to uh, too many stuff to do at the end, on the ending or the uh, the final battle final tape yeah there's there's a lot going on that's for sure there was a lot going on there's a lot of things that you needed to avoid a lot of things that you uh that you needed to kill and that's why i just i i love this game for itself for its good uh, good parts 
like uh, it doesn't over uh, overwhelm you with everything that's gonna that's going on, right? Here comes the savior. Oh yeah, the here comes the savior was a good good one. I like that. Uh, yeah, those one, those those songs are just so good. Whatever it takes. I'm not sure what that is, but. Oh wait! I didn't play the music. I didn't. Oh no! Can I? I hope I could. I hope I could go back. Shoot! Shoot me! Shoot! Uh, yeah. Let's just thank these guys for, for these people, for making this game, because it's a really good game. They just overwhelmed me with everything that, that was going on. The uh, the last part. a good game. They made a good horror game. Good story as well. It shows you all these uh, these stuff. These uh, emotions. These uh, these anxiety anxiety uh, PTSD scare, uh, phobias The other one was, uh, yeah, anxiety, anger issues, anger, anger management, all those stuff were really good. I loved how they integrated those things, those uh, those illnesses or uh, disorders, to. Uh, to be the theme of every enemy that you encounter, or the uh, the, the or the patients. The enemies are your patients, but uh, you're trying to uh, do everything in your power to power to do what's best for them. It's like those fight scenes, those uh, those parts. Oh, thanks to Jeremy Klitskin. Tomer Burke Barkin, Eddie Ron, Yossi Aviv, Sam Pearson. Okay, this is, yep, thank you for playing. But yeah, uh, those enemies uh, in those parts, it's like uh, you're letting them face their fears. That's, that, that's what I liked about that part, those parts. Desmond! Oh! Desmond, oh! can you hear me? Are you in there? Damn it. Desmond, you're breathing. Yes. I heard you, man. I heard you in the back of my mind. My goodness, what did you do to this place? Judging by the package on the table, I guess they got to you before I did. Bastards. You'll be all right, my friend. Rest. And when you feel better, we'll take the fight to them. Sequel? Diamond, is there gonna be a sequel? Oh man. Let's see if I could play the uh, the audio. The the vinyl. Desmond's vinyl. It's my record player. Oh no. Nothing. I gotta go to my room first again. I'll get back to you all.
that's a good song though. Oh, are we missing something, or is it actually just that? Because this is for the yeah, maybe. Unless I'm missing something over here. All right, so now I found Rosemary's vinyl, but the problem is I wasn't recording, so I can't go back. But it was in the uh, cemetery. You had to find it using your using your this this radio emitter. It's my something. record player. But yeah. Here we go, and here we go. Wake, try to be good, for goodness sake. Try to learn from the past, from your mistakes. Do it over, whatever it takes. Finally, whatever it takes. That one sounded like uh, what's that game? Uh, what's that song? Yeah. Bright as the sunshine, let the rain fall. I don't care. Oh no, it's brighter than sunshine. Brighter than sunshine. Yeah, it's it does sound like that one, but yeah, I like I love all these these songs. It's a uh, very uh, very diverse with the genre it it's uh, going for. Uh, all those are pretty good songs. But yeah, that's it for us for today. Thank you. Uh, I just love that. They made a great game over here. I just love the uh, the idea, and they delivered on that idea, that concept that they wanted to to do. I just love indie games for these games that they make out of passion, out of out of passion. That's the most important part of making a video game. Not like a not like AAA games that make these uh, these overly saturated uh, video games like COD even horror games as well they've been 
and zo uh, horror games and zombie games uh, have been oversaturated to the p to the point of there's ju they're just making them to make money. But all in all, I love this. I love this game, even even with its flaws. Uh, like like the, uh, the the last fight, the last fight was one of the most frustrating things that I've uh, that I've experienced for quite a while. I haven't died in that long or uh, that that much uh, for so long. No, no, maybe not so long because I died a lot of times in Assassin's Creed 2. But yeah, that is it for us for today. Thank you everybody so much for watching. I hope you all liked it. Please hit like, share, subscribe, and the bell button so you wouldn't miss an episode. And for more gaming content like this, let me know if you have any suggestions and advice, comments, or games that you want me to play. And uh, if my next game is up, I'll put it right here and in the description below. But keep it good, keep it fun, but most importantly, peace everyone. V. Oh. Whoa! 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 Yeah! I didn't want to do that! Whoa! 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 You're dead now. Good idea. Whoa! Is it going? Whoa! 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 Subscribe to me. Tell me. Do you know his name? Hey! It's V's Gameplays!